Hello everyone and welcome to Freightmaster Resources. Uh, it is January the 5th, 2020 and today's topic is how you can make a hundred thousand dollars a year in the transportation industry. Now many of you probably don't know a lot about the logistics or the transportation industry. Um, it is a 700 billion dollar a year plus industry. Um, probably a, lo a lot of you probably don't know any more about it than those big scary things you see going down the highway. You know, uh, big trucks delivering. Um, a lot of us probably don't give it a second thought that, you know, virtually everything we buy in the store or order online that gets delivered to our home gets delivered on a truck. Okay you can be a part of that process without a college degree with some training and a few resources and make a hundred thousand dollars a year or more okay um, one of the first things that you're going to need to do seeing as how probably most of you don't have any experience is you're going to have to find some freight training and you're going to have to be self-motivated. If you're not self-motivated, if you're a couch potato, stop watching the video now and, I don't know, go watch an old episode of Spongebob or something, okay? Um, but uh, for those of you that are, you know, willing to hustle, um, you know, be self-motivated, uh, can work at home without distraction, you can make six figures a year or more, okay, as a freight agent. And, you know, once you've got your feet wet, you know, you've, you, you've made some money as a freight agent, you can open up your own brokerage, you know. Um, I, there are those out there that open their own brokerage without any prior experience, um, maybe just taking a freight training class. Um, I don't suggest it um, until you've actually started to move some freight. Um, but let's kind of jump into, you know, a few of the tools and things that you'll need to get started. Um, and again, you, you don't need a college degree for this. Um, you know, uh, one of the things you probably want to start out doing is go to visit a, a website like FreightBrokerResources.com. Okay, I'm going to leave a link down in the description for you know all this. Um, and there's a knowledge center. You know, if if you are opening up your own brokerage, you know, uh, deciding what your business structure. Uh, getting your authority, your surety bond, insurance, and things like this. But as an agent, um, you know you don't you're you're not going to be required to have any of this because you're going to be working under another broker's authority. Okay. Typical split, um, and what I mean by split is what you make uh, per load is averages is a it's a sixty forty split is the average. Um, of the net profit, okay. So, for every hundred dollars in net profit, you make sixty dollars, and the broker gets forty dollars, okay. So, um, and that's just you know uh, an example, but you can literally make hundreds of dollars per load, all right. Um, we jump over here to the resources page um, and click on freight broker training. Uh, we do have some freight broker training uh, on here that we suggest. Um, freight broker boot camp, uh, really great training. Uh, you can learn at your own pace um, from home. Uh, you know, no classes to, that you need to attend or anything like this. Um, you know, really, really great uh, training program. Again, you know, whether you're going into it as a freight broker or a freight agent. Okay. Um, now this this job does require sales. Okay, that's going to be a, one of the biggest parts about your about doing this job. All right. Now, if you don't have any prior sales experience, um, feel like you need a little bit more um, in addition to the uh, freight training. Okay, there is freight sales training that is available to you through Facebook. Um, on a monthly or yearly plan, okay, and you can get signed up through there, um, and they'll go over uh, tips and techniques, um, how to get past the gatekeeper, um, 
things like this, you know, um, and whatnot to, you know, find your prospect and, and be able to reach out to them and secure that freight. All right. And we'll get into more of the freight sales training and things like this in future videos. But just kind of laying down the basics for everybody for now. Um, again, you know, you're going to, one of the first things you're going to need is, is the freight training. Okay. Um, another thing you're going to need is freight sales leads. Okay. Uh, we go back up here to the uh, resources page. Now, there are lots of places that you can find um, shipper leads. Again, kind of going back to what I said earlier, virtually there are leads all around us. Everything that, that we buy online, you know, in the store comes by truck. Okay. So, Everywhere you look, you know, all the advertising, you know, there, there's literally customers everywhere throughout the U.S., Mexico, Canada, you know, um, there, there's an abundance of them out there. Um, going out and securing those leads and the information, pre-qualifying uh, those prospects um, and, and doing that all of that on your own can be a bit time consuming. Um, and again, we'll get into that, you know, if you decide, you know, not to purchase a, a list. Um, it, but for those of you that kind of more or less want to jump start um, and, you know, kind of a cheat sheet, if you will, um, uh, on having those leads, 100,000 plus leads is more than enough to, to build your portfolio. Okay. Um, and it's got complete information. Um, you know, contact name, phone number, uh, what they're shipping, and things like this. Um, I would also suggest, which again, we'll get into this a little bit more in depth in future videos, uh, is deciding on a niche. They'll probably touch on that during the freight sale or the freight uh, agent training um, as well uh, that we showed you earlier. Okay. <clears throat> Links again to all of this will be down in the description. Um, Another thing that I would suggest doing is joining a Facebook group, okay, an industry-related Facebook group. A uh, lot of great information there. Uh, you know, feel free to ask questions. You know, if you stumble, um, find a mentor, uh, connect with uh, freight carriers and other freight agents, brokers, things like this. Uh, LinkedIn is another great uh, resource to get connected, um, you know, and to kind of network and, and find, you know, additional tools that you may need. Now, Freight Broker Resources is more or less sort of an all-in-one uh, for the most part, um, you know, so that you're not having to jump around from here to there. Um, but again, LinkedIn and Facebook, I would suggest, you know, outside of Freight Broker Resources to get involved in. <coughs> um, there is also uh, some industry news. You know, uh, what's kind of going on in the industry, um, avoiding any pitfalls, uh, what freight volumes are like, things like this. And I, and I realize, you know, for a lot of you, maybe some of this is overwhelming, but ultimately breaking it down, it, it doesn't take a lot. It just, it just takes a little self-motivation. Um, again, some training, you know, which you can probably complete in about a month. Um, there, there's an abundance of different freight training out there. This is just the one that we suggest. Um, it, really great guy. Um, actually owned his own brokerage and uh, sold it, uh, doing millions of dollars a year. So definitely worth checking out. Um, but, uh, but yeah, um, for those of you that are looking, you know, to make a really good income from home, you know, give it a shot. You know, you, you have nothing to lose, you know, um, it, it's legitimate. There's no, you know, affiliate marketing, no, you know, selling on eBay, you know, needing a website, developing this, you know, none of that, you know, just some simple training and some resources and you too can make a hundred thousand dollars a year or more as a freight agent. Okay. Um, 
but again, I, I, I need to make this abundantly clear because I've seen, you know, um, other people kind of jump into the industry and just kind of think everything's going to happen. You are going to need to be self-motivated, okay? Um, find a quiet place, you know, set aside an, a, an area, you know, to work from. Um, and literally all you're going to need aside from the training and your sales leads is cell phone with unlimited minutes or, you know, a home phone. Um, and a computer, and that can be a laptop, desktop, you know, uh, tablet, um, and uh, you're you're pretty much ready to get started. Um, don't necessarily need a fax machine or anything like that. Um, if you wanted to go ahead and get set up with a CRM or or something, a customer relationship management uh, system, uh, we suggest HubSpot. Uh, that's a, a, a free tool that you can use to kind of help keep track of, you know, <clears throat> your contacts and things like that. And again, we'll get into some of this and, and we'll provide some uh, freight sales uh, kind of tips and techniques and things like this in future videos. Um, if you guys found this video helpful, um, want to learn more, um, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button. And we look forward to seeing you back here next time. Uh, if you have any questions in the meantime, you know, post a comment uh, or use the contact us page right here and uh, shoot us an email. All right. Uh, look forward to seeing you guys here next time and good luck in 2020.